This sweet, sweet little video is protected by fair use. It is not for profit. It is for free. You can share this freely. It is for the purposes of comedy, entertainment, criticism, commentary. Thanks for watching. Please like this video if you enjoy my content. It helps support the channel. Click the like button. It takes half a second. This video is for mature audiences only, adults only. Viewer discretion is advised. Hey, 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 hold on. Somebody told me about this. My comments, look at this. Hello, my name is Daddy, official cult leader, this guy. Okay? A Jinji, it looks like. Here's Benton. I don't know what face he's making. Here's this Hacklebus character. Here's Bex. She doesn't have the capital X's at the end, just B-E-X-X. -X. Look at this. There she is, everyone. There she is. There's the one that finally get to see her, really. The one that was on my uh, channel all those hours as a guest. One that banned me from her channel. The one that was on Crimes of Beauty when it went down. She was live as a guest. Interesting, isn't it? She's been talking about me. What do you think? Does she look feminine? As I verify, I'm the man on some level that I know I need to be. And because they feel they're not, they got to fight against daddy and show how much daddy didn't love them the right way. But they can't equalize with daddy. And you know, so along it, those it's lines. It's your egoic problem, not mine. And you know, along those lines, the scripture tells us to pay tribute to our Father which is in heaven for his instruction. And we're supposed to pay tribute to our mother in earth for her law. So when we speak about law, everybody wants to point out to the law, the law, the law. No, the law, the law. Instruction. I'm starting to understand when she said she had the shoulders for it. I Maybe she does have the shoulders. Kind of has the jaw, too. Look at this. Look at this. I'm not trying to be mean here. I'm just, I'm not trying to be mean, but. Uh, wow. And she's 50-something years old and thinks she can still have a baby, get pregnant. Is, am I in the Twilight Zone? What is going on here? What is going on here? My goodness. The law. Instruction. The law. It's that simple. You're supposed to listen to your father in heaven for the instruction and pay tribute to your mother in earth for the law this is the sabbath every seven days and the sabbath this every guy's seven preaching the sabbath this is who she hangs out with this is just incredible to me <laughs> i'm not i don't even know what to say to some of this stuff he's preaching the sabbath this guy heckle bus okay this guy says hello my name is daddy this paul guy this is benton which she loves and says is her brother he looks like he's in a motel this whole this whole uh panel here gives me motel people vibes i gotta say it gives me vote motel people vibes uh, something about this uh, is, is her is her shower broken I, i'm not sure i'm just asking questions here and then here it's support the broadcast broadcast patreon paul unslaved paypal unslaved you, do you people give money to this stuff i don't know do people give money to this stuff really She's probably looking at this going, I want some of that money. He is probably too. He's like, damn, I'm in this shitty motel, you know? Wow. Something. There's something. Jesus Christ, what the hell's going on here? Pimp. They're, they're the pimp of what? The motel people? I mean, I don't know what to say to this. I don't know what to say. Is this Frankenstein? What was that guy in that movie? Um, 
before, I think. Hunchback. Huh. What's going on around here? What is this? What did I just stumble into? Is this a circus or this is, is this a freak show? A sideshow? I don't know what I stumbled upon here. I'm sorry, people. I'm sorry. So it was Vivat Cat that told me about this going on. This shit show. Okay? So I looked it. I looked it up. And damn, this is uh this is something. Hey guys, she's single. Ladies too, I don't know. I don't know. Look at the neck on this giraffe here, Benton. Look at this. What is going on here? This guy calls himself the white gorilla, I think, but what is going on here? They all know each other? They sat beside each other on a <laughs> on a live stream? Wow, this is incredible. This is gold. Thank you. Thank you to Vivat Cat, Vivat for for sharing this with me, telling me about this, because I didn't know there was this out there. Never heard of this channel before. Daddy loves you. Look at this. Daddy loves you. Well, I think she has some issues. She has some daddy issues. This is interesting, isn't it? Fascinating stuff. Ogden, first of all, this is what I never understood. I did everything on the street thinking that I was going to prison. I just had to figure out what I was going to do that if I got caught for, I'd do the least amount of time or be able to get out of it, right? So that's how I approached it. How people do all this shit and never expect consequences is beyond me, right? When I went to, when I went to prison as a very young man, the prison... Why have they all been to prison on YouTube? They've all been to prison, these YouTubers. Or they've been homeless. Prison, prison, homeless, homeless, addict. I don't know if she's been an addict. I think so. He's been an addict. It's just incredible. Really, it, it really is. Toilet Bowl Earth is an addict. It, it's incredible. There's so many of them. So many of them. And people watch this stuff. It's incredible to me. You think you're going to get truth from that? From that? Really? They think nothing of lying to you and misleading you and trying to get money from you. You know? My video is fair use. Says Prisons something, weren't overrun by gang. Says something here about broadcast as fair use educational purposes. Fascinating. Guys, I think she's still single. She's in her 50s. Okay? She said she had the... She, she has said that she has the shoulders for this. For this stuff. She has the shoulders. Of, I, didn't, I don't think she said the shoulders of a linebacker, but she did say she has the shoulders. I, I, I think she neglected to say that she doesn't have a neck for it. I don't think she has a neck, but she has the shoulders, apparently. And uh, she doesn't have a bottom lip, it looks like. She's missing. I don't know what's going on here. I'm trying to figure this out. I'm not trying to be mean. I'm trying to figure something out here. I've, I've never seen... This is the first time I've seen... Uh, I don't want to assume their gender, but Bex and Benton and on a channel like this, on a panel, on a panel, on a drama panel like this, on webcams... So I don't know what's going on. I didn't know he looked like this. He uses an avatar. This is interesting. This is interesting. Hotel people vibes right here. Okay? Wow. What the hell? These almost look like mug shots. You know what I'm saying? They almost look like mug shots. You know? Seriously. It wasn't a prison. It was the Iowa Reformatory. And a motherfucker had to walk that yard by himself and prove himself. So we had three classes of people in the prison that uh, we dealt with severely. 
pedos, of course, snitches, of course. And then there's the beta cuck that comes in from the street that's on a murder charge because he accidentally killed somebody while he was trying to rob them mm. and wants to talk about he's a murderer. No, you're not. You're a bitch that fell and accidentally killed somebody. You keep running your mouth, you're going to get treated just like the pedos and the snitches. Shut the fuck up and learn how to walk the walk. Look at her nodding her head. These are the people she hangs out with. Look at this. Look at this. Wow, this is incredible. Look at his head shape there. Look at the skull. Like some of these people could be in an anthropology museum or something. I mean, it's just, I don't know what to say, but what? What is going on here? What is going on? How long is that neck? Benton, could you give her some neck? Could you spare some neck to give away to Bex? She loves you, Benton. You're her brother. Could you give a bit of the neck to here, to her? I'm sorry, people. I got. I have to comment on this. Like this is, this is just crazy. This is ridiculous. Here's the chain smoker. This is interesting. And you can donate to PayPal here at Unslave, but. I think she wants some money. She wants some cigarettes money. Guy's just going to sit down here and smile. Truth is my soul. I don't think he's on any real truth channels. They don't have a clue, these people. They don't have a clue. They're not just lost, a lot of them. They're just, they're like this guy. They're like this. Look at the eyes. This guy would, this guy would capital M, you know what? one of your relatives or loved ones in a heartbeat, this this guy here, okay? These are my friends. I, found a, I feel like I found a real family here, a real family here. That's my voice impression of Bex. I feel like I found a real family here. Huffing away on her, chain smoking on her, you know, trying to smoke a whole cart in a day, for fuck's sake. It's just incredible. Isn't this something? Come on, Benton, be a good guy. She loves you like a brother. Donate some of that long neck. Give her some neck. Give her some neck. Come on, dude. Be generous. Give her some neck. You got some to spare. Okay? Just the truth. He's got the long turkey neck. And she, or a swan neck, or giraffe. He's a giraffe man. I don't know if there's hybrids, but she she needs some. She needs some to get her head off her shoulders. Please help her out. I'm sorry, people. I just can't help it. What am I looking at here? What am I looking at? Remember when I asked Angry Gingy the other night if, if, if he believes that gingers are some kind of mutation? I mean, what am I looking at on the screen? That's what I'm wondering, okay? Again, I'm sorry, people, but I have to be honest here. What happened in this realm? What the fuck has gone on to cause this? Look at this. Look what's on the screen. Holy shit. I'm sorry. I can't help it. <laughs> oh, 13 minutes and 33 seconds just went by. I'm going to, I'm, I'm holding back. I, I'm going to go into a full on laugh attack. If I, I got to play more of this, I'm sorry. <laughs> This is just incredible. This is incredible. Okay. Or else you're not going to make it either. Because you know why? There's people in those fucking life and lifestyle that got into that game for different reasons and have continued it. And part of their struggle inside of themselves is they don't like themselves and what they're involved in but they got to continue it because their ass is on the line. So they you don't think they're going to try to be like them. They're going to tell you, stay the fuck away from me and out of this if you were smart because you're going to get yourself involved in something you ain't ready for, right? That's a motherfucker who's lived it and walked it and been the distance telling you this ain't all what you think it is, right? You want to tattoo your face and act like you're this and that. Well, they're going to send hits for you to do. You got to hit. Look at these YouTube gangsters on here. Look at the hair here as she turns to the side. Look at the, how many chins? There's more chins there than a Chinese phone book. It's a joke. It's just a joke. But um, look at the hair. 
Um, could somebody donate some shampoo to her, conditioner, some, um, what do they call it, toiletries, just, you know, like you'd give to the homeless? You might put a care package together with toothpaste, toothbrush, um, some mouthwash, something to take away the, the cigarette stains and the cigarette stink, maybe a mouthwash with uh, hydrogen peroxide or something for, you know, whitening. I don't know. She's just, uh, is this guy in the motel there? This is just a mess. I'm sorry, people. This I'm sorry, people, but this is a mess. This is a mess. You ever seen Andre the Giant's daughter? <laughs> I, I'm sorry, people. I, I, I gotta, I gotta, you know, spice it up and get, make some humor here. She called herself a stand-up comedian. Well, she doesn't have much material. Toilet bowl, gingy. <laughs> Hit this guy today. Go get a knife and hit him. What do you mean? I'm going to do 10 more years. We don't give a fuck, bro. We're doing 40. So you're going to go do the hit on the guy the same way we did. This is how you get your bones in this industry, right? You all want to yeah. talk that shit and you want to pretend to put on on a screen or out of jail or wherever else. And then you project it onto me. I ain't involved in none of that. I hardly ever blink just staring. Look at the eyes. Look at the eyes on them. They tell everything. They tell them themselves with their eyes. They show you what they are. I want to see who's watching this junk over here. Look at this. Who hangs out on these channels? Look at this. Another lineup of consciousness with the heavens. See a great panel of quality people. Quality people. <laughs> oh, they have to be trolling. They're called no to, not a troll too. I mean, what the hell? Mama Bex? Mama Bex? Telling Bex, stop umming all the time. The the word of the one talking cannot be heard. He said her voice projects. Well, her body projects. I mean, you know, what am I saying? Is there genetic mutation going on in this realm? What happened to these people? What happened? What happened here? Whales and giraffes and, you know, this guy's, I don't know what that is, but. I stay away from it. I stay out of it at this point because I was involved with the wrong people and realized what I was about to experience and realized it was all because I was broken. Once I started fixing myself and realized, nah, these are loser failures. No offense. These are broken people. They're destroying themselves and others. When I get to talking with them late at night when they're drinking, they don't like themselves in their life. They're crying to me. St. Pauli boy, you know, you got something in you that's leading and guiding you. Stay the fuck away from us and what we're doing because you you ain't really about it anyway. And I'd say you're right because every time you folks want to do this shit, I go, nah, we shouldn't do that. We don't need to live like that and do that. Call me soft. Call me a pussy. Call me a bitch, whatever. I don't like doing harm to myself and others. I think it's sick and twisted. Okay. See, that's, and, yeah, and I think that's the hard. largest part of it is the self-respect. People, when they bring their children up in this public education system, there's no education about respect. None. You hand your children over to the public education system thinking they're going to get educated in all realms, including discipline. No, that's for the father of the household. 
and that's where we lose it. The family is destroyed by this, this missing and displacing the father of the house. And then mom thinks that she's disciplining. The mom is supposed to teach your children reading, writing, arithmetic, and the basics of life. The father is supposed to teach the entire family about respect, respecting the father's instruction and the mother's laws. Anything else? Above X is unusually quiet over here. You notice that? Vex isn't talking it up like she was on my channel. So what's going on here? Her camera kept going off, but what was what was going on over here? Doesn't she say anything? Time. So they don't want to yep. listen to a woman. They don't want to be checked by a woman. They don't want to be held accountable by a woman. They're too. Interesting. Shows that I was a good teacher, right? If a kung fu master teaches students mm -hmm. good enough to one day karate chop his bitch ass and make him feel it, he's going to feel it, but he's also going to say, I'm kind of proud of you, if you get what I'm saying. Mm -hmm. So they don't want to yep. listen to a woman. They don't want to be checked by a woman. They don't want to be held accountable by a woman. They're too busy in that mama spirit they got. Uh, they got enough of that on their own without you being involved. And again, for this guy down here smiling like, He's got a cleft right there in his chin. It almost like looks like one ball is hanging lower than the other in the chin. You can I don't know if you can see that, but his face I, I can't help it. I mean, it's just noticeable to me. I'm not making fun of the guy. This guy's head is just you know I don't know how to describe that as, but uh, eggplant shaped. It's just so, something weird. I don't know what happened here in this realm. Poor people, these poor creatures. They're hybrids of some kind. Giraffe, a whale, you know. That calls himself a white gorilla. He's a gingy. I don't know what to, uh, what is going on here. The hell is going on? I didn't get a chance to ask Angry Gingy if he likes Wendy's burgers and Wendy's logo with the when you know the wendy with the red hair right on the uh logo and the the packaging they put on their burgers and everything and they're you know what i'm saying people you know what i you know what i'm getting at of course of course you do <laughs> what is this look at this guy don't stare at me like that what's wrong with you didn't anybody teach you some manners jesus christ it's just unbelievable. For a man, it looks prideful and egoic, as in, I'm not going to listen to you as a woman. And just you watch, right? Where they're doing the whole, like, mm -hmm. you know, when Beyonce tells them in the left, to the left, put all your shit in the box to the left. They're on the way out telling her, you don't understand, Beyonce. Jay-Z's going to manipulate you. He's the worst thing ever. He's blah, blah, blah. And she's like, just box to the left, please. You ain't shit, right? Now's not the time to try to convince me. We already saw who and what everybody is, right? So what are the odds you're going to convince mm -hmm. Beyonce? Who will what happened to loud, outspoken Bex interrupting everyone? This was just a couple months ago, you know? It says it was streamed two months ago. What the hell happened in two months? Come on, Bex. Where's that loud, strong, you know, strong, shrill woman? <laughs> I can't help it. <laughs> Look at this. The faces, oh. I'm sorry, I should have given a warning before starting this video. It may disturb some viewers. This may disturb some viewers. Jesus Christ. Who 
40 percent this pimping is so strong i can pull my dick out yeah. at this point and women are still <laughs> loving me and see the value in my presentment yeah. are you kidding i have yeah. so much power and influence at this point through authenticity everything you don't have that you're, you're that's just she wants that power and influence look at her face she's wondering how does this guy do it how does this guy get thousands of subscribers how does he do it i want that too that's what she's thinking and this guy's just thinking that he wishes he could hurt someone. Look at this. Look at this. It's just nowhere to go with it, right? I, I'm better off just continuing to do what I do and serving the people and giving them the good game, right? Telling it, not selling it. They get so much value in that and give value back to me that by me focusing on you, I'm detracting from my work and my purpose and my path. Mm -hmm. That's the only mm -hmm. thing these people are good for is to use them as a talking point, an example for me to break down uh, the idea of knowledge itself for us to take back to the world and live with it. Cause we got to live around people like this. That's the only place I ever saw value in this. Mm -hmm. As I've said from the beginning, I just use them as a simulation example to break them down show you the mirror, give it back to you, take it to your life. I'm not emotionally invested in these characters. These are whack packers as far as I'm concerned. You got a doctor who, you yeah. got an audiologist who can't listen properly. You can't make this shit up. Mm -hmm. I know. I got a lawyer who couldn't yeah. pass the bar, right? I mean, do I need to go down the list again? Mm -hmm. I got a transformational life coach who failed all of his own assessments. Hey, a Sal I have a, a list of backpackers who ex <laughs> exemplify extreme incompetence and inability to be aware of themselves and others. Go ahead, sir. Well, Sal was a stockbroker. No, no stockbroker and no homoerotic <laughs> kick yet. <laughs> oh, man. Well, I just want to say sorry. I know I don't think they got me my service inside on purpose. I don't know. I can only get service outside now. It's so weird. So I have to step out for a second and do it like that. Yeah, this whole thing really writes itself a lot yeah. of the time. Then they all go in the chat. They go, we think everyone's working behind the scenes to make all this. I go, no, it's far <laughs> more insidious. Uh, this is a cop. Why doesn't she have anything to say here? This is weird. Really strange. She's face is on there, but she doesn't seem to be saying anything. Is she ever going to speak? Look at the neck. Clone maximized drama, tization, you know. Now, I have an announcement to make. Uh, I was mm -hmm. just going to step away and I've received a notification on my phone. I haven't been live in hours. I'm getting subscribers. Isn't that amazing how that works? Wow. Shocking. See, I'll if you back. just sit here and <laughs> shut the fuck up, Benton, take notes. <laughs> You're still doing better. Well, this is what they all don't figure out. They do better just that's sitting something next I, to me, shutting the fuck up and letting me monologue for two hours. They get more subscribers. Candy, they can't mm -hmm. even use me right, Benton, these people. Mm -hmm. It's something I noticed actually when I was streaming, like just playing around trying to figure out what I wanted to do, not realizing, you know, really that you could be uh, competing with people. I wasn't thinking about that. But I had noticed that the last time I was on London's channel, I lost four subscribers, right? I had a small amount of people so I could notice those things. And I thought I was actually being respectful of his audience by staying away for a few shows. Um, and uh, on that same note, in that time period, that's when I started working with Benton and, uh, you know, sort of discovering that I wasn't being as authentic as I thought I was, you know, engaging in frustrated conversations with people that we're looping, you know, forcing myself to continue to tolerate conversations with people trying to make the most of whatever they're saying, you know? And I, that's why I feel like going in to talk to Jack Talcott yesterday with you um, was sort of, it did have a bit of a mission because like he, he claims he wants to, you know, learn to communicate better, but he's dissolved to being, you know, incapable of actually stringing a sentence together. 
you know? Um, and I don't mean to say that like super harsh to him. I'm just saying like it, it makes me think about how much we can, like the chat can support people to become delusional and be incapable of actually understanding their role in that, not blaming the chat, you know, like, um, yeah. So it's just like, it's really nuanced, you know, to be like, and that's why I have to thank like London for sort of like dragging me or at least making me feel dragged because then I feel like I can go in and call, call someone out to the best of my ability on something that is authentically expressing care, you know, like, yeah. You know, like dragged and spiral and loop and yeah, it's just the, the, she just wants to be on with someone, whether it's with Benton uh, Jack Talcott, London, this guy. She just wants someone to latch on to to get subscribers. It's just incredible. Look at this. Look at this. Despicable. Despicable. Burning Lou Festival and all the rest of it, okay? Hi, thank when the time you for having comes, me up. I'll hold the event like Tal Stock. I'll make all the profits from it, and then I'll light your big greasy body on fire to emulate you and commemorate all the animals that you killed and now your time comes to be sacrificed uh for valhalla so bye thank you for being here lewis thanks for uh, coming thanks for having us me all out once again and that's you that's your motive that's your job so you you, you fulfilled that you got that done uh now so get out got, how much you're gonna pay me next time be generous my face. okay <laughs> That's it. Uh, I'm stuck on narcissism, Paul. Well, you've been hanging around a narcissist so often lately, this Paulie Unslaved character, that it's bound to fucking entrance you and entice you. So you're hooked forever, most likely. But I know. I'm totally culted up, like right off the bat. Um, but I was going to say that narcissi Narcissus, or Narcissus, his name, whatever his name fucking was, he died because he was like so in love with his own reflection, right? It was all superficial, you know, it was all superficial. So whether it's his reflection in a pool, a pond without water, you know, with water and no money or in his... You told the same narcissist story of uh, looking, into, looking at his own reflection in the pond several times on my channel. It's just incredible. She just repeats herself all over and they just look at this like, oh, What's she talking about? Every didn't everybody hear this in elementary school or or high school? And she's oh man. <laughs> look at look at her glasses though. She tells the same thing. You're a narc. She's a narc. That's why she likes telling that story. his own like golden bars of wealth you know what i mean like or silver bars of wealth right like i don't think that there's anything about like that's so superficial that anything we ponder here like there is the opposite of narcissism right like you can't because that's looking within so even even the metric of intelligence right like to say you're smart and to know you're in a certain percentile that's that's not flaunting anything. That's just sharing your gift with people, right? Like, just like someone would come in and paint a painting or whatever, right? Um, so, yeah, I think this, nar you know, this narcissistic term and, and the generalization of it is exactly the people who cast that word. Said you can't paint. You have to use AI. You can't paint paintings. You can't draw. You've admitted that. All of her avatars are done using AI programs. Part of why she's jealous of me and bashing me. I see what you are. I see what you are. Word out, you know, just like the ones that call people liars or, you know, players or gamers or whatever, right? Um, I don't know. It's just, uh, 
Definitely yeah, not any narcissist. Yeah. Lying and cheating every day in his life. He's calling the pimper, the player, the dishonest one. While the pimper, the mm -hmm. player never lies once to the, to the woman or to the, to the other people they're dealing with. That's what makes mm -hmm. them a real pimp or a player is they don't lie. They don't bullshit. Mm -hmm. So they got it like that yeah. because the rest of you got to lie and bullshit. That motherfucker doesn't. And still we'll get access to all. Okay, and then she just again, look at this. Look at, she's throwing up the Freemasonic sign, grabbing her glasses this way. Look at this. Do you understand? She's caught. All right. She is caught right there. She did it twice in a row. She made sure she was staring at the camera and made it obvious what she's doing. She wants to be part of the club. And uh, there's something very, very fishy about Bex. Okay. Very, very fishy. And I'm not talking about her not washing properly or hygiene. If you get what I'm saying, I'm talking about so there's something very, very fishy about her. All right. Thanks for watching, everyone. Bye.